up you guys how have you been i missed you i legit missed you it's been what over a month now ah see life it may happen see a lot was going on ah from my birthday from moving oh that's how you see it's a different background is it vibrant is it all white and stuff are you happy to be here yeah so a lot has happened a lot has happened um we moved after moving my birthday after my birthday engagement after engagement work after work here we are not even after work because work came before all those other things but really it's been so hectic for me trying to balance out my job and youtube Oh man, I don't know how people do it, guys. I don't know how people do it. But um, now I know how my schedule looks like. And I know that I will be able to... I will know when I will be shooting. Because I promised videos on Mondays. Sundays looks like a best time to do it. But then sometimes on Sundays I'm so occupied. I don't know what I'm going to do. But yeah. I'll figure it out guys i'll figure it out don't worry don't worry we are together in this yeah so welcome and welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is diana diana and jerry oh people call me brooks you can call me brooks as well i don't mind okay yeah so that's what's up thank you so much for being here god bless you as usual uh as usual i love you guys i love you guys and i'm so glad that you're here thank you so much for being here Woo. okay let's dive right into this video let's talk about real life stuff let's talk about real life stuff <gasps> oh, okay great so this is what's up so my last video i shot last month and it happened that after that i got a job and then this job became so demanding because I was new. There were a ton of trainings that I needed to attend. And then I still needed to work. So it became too much work for me. It became a bit overwhelming because I didn't even have time to myself. Saturdays, there, there were Saturdays that I went to work. And uh, on Sundays, I go to church, hang out with my friends. And that's the only time I get to socialize. And I maximize on it and come back home late. And I don't have time to prepare for a shoot or anything like that and monday is here i need to wake up by four. Oh, it's crazy it was crazy it has been crazy but you guys i'm back i'm back oh i'm back it feels so good to be back and thank you so much for staying tuned thank you so much for still remaining a faithful follower faithful subscriber i love you i love you so so much so let's dive right into whatever happened while i was away so number one while i was away we moved we moved to another house that's why you see my background is different oh for those who don't know i still live with my mother i'm still my mother's child deal with it deal with it i'm still my mother's child <laughs> anyway yeah so we moved still within the same location just to a different house and it's been uh, trying to settle, trying to decorate, you know, um, kind of interior design for our house. <laughs> so all I just do, I just try to put things together. I know the color codes have changed. So we're still trying to decorate and stuff like that. So yeah, basically that is what happened. Number one. Number two, I'm a match baby. How can you not love match babies? I am a match baby and I love the fact that I am a match baby. If you know me, you know I love match babies. Okay, so my birthday happened and I turned 26, guys. It's so weird. Like, you know, I only turned 26, but I can even feel changes with my body. I was listening to Sharon Mundia. She was talking about when she turned 30, how her hormones started changing and everything. But for me, I also feel the same. Okay, not really. Not that I have turned 30, but you guys, now I'm getting a, a bloated stomach during my period. That sucks. Like, you literally look pregnant, you guys. 
<sighs> I've been walking around with a bloated stomach. It's not funny. So to those guys, to those ladies who go through bloated stomach during the ovulation or when you're about to get their period or during their period, you guys, how do you do it? Please share with me what are your hacks because I'm getting that now. So is this what mid-20s brings? I mean, it's not cute, but it is what it is so yeah i turned 26 and imagine that's like <laughs> one of the things i experienced instead of saying something nice or something lovely i begin with ranting ah <sighs> but i love my 26 i love 26 i'm in my mid 20s it, i'm becoming more aware of what i want in life i'm becoming more aware of the things i want to do in future of the kind even the timelines by this time i want to have done this career wise i'm more aware of what i need to do about it i'm more aware of becoming a better person of my to myself i'm more aware of being kind to myself you know like i'm i'm, I'm so aware about so many things now i know that i'm legit 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 a salesperson and i stopped fighting it like Man, oh man, for how long will I, you know, I thought to myself, how long am I going to fight the fact that I'm a salesperson? Like, babes, you are a salesperson, stop fighting it. So just go ahead and thrive in it. And I will tell you for a fact, it's not easy, but I'm thriving. I am thriving. Haven't gotten to the best yet, but we're on that road. We are in that road. Oh, and by the way, I look all official because I was dressed for work. And then I thought, why not shoot today before I leave? Yeah, my job is that flexible. Like, dude, I get to shoot. I'm going to work at the same time in the morning. It's around 10 a.m. in the morning. Yeah. And yeah, I'm so happy about that. Got this video. I hope it doesn't become too long because I have so many things to talk about. So we are talking about work, right? So work became very difficult for me. It didn't become really difficult. Like everything else became so difficult to catch up with. The only thing, the much I could do was just get on bed as maybe late as 11 or like there was so much work to be done. So yeah and the training so i couldn't like match up with the youtube channel i couldn't keep up but now i have gotten the hang of it it's been a month now and uh now i know what to do i know how i could organize myself and uh produce content okay 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 ah oh, god i missed you like oh, being in front of the camera and talking and I missed you guys. That's all I'm saying, okay? <laughs> anyway, Sawa. So, so we're done talking about work. So that's what's up. That was how, that is what has been happening with work. Oh, what do I do? You guys, I sell insurance. I'm a sales agent. Like I'm a financial advisor. Yeah. Yeah. Career wise, it's financial advisor, but it's more of sales. Yeah. So if you need help with your long term goals, I'm your go to. I'm your go to okay yeah so i'm with prudential and yeah that's what i do that's what i do if you need advice on your finances on your long-term goals on goals that you want to achieve in 10 years 15 20 i am your go-to person don't be shy just hit my dms eh? i'm gonna put my instagram and my facebook so we can communicate okay great so that that's what's up that's what's up that's how work has been. Um, what do we talk about? My birthday, you guys. You guys, did I tell you? Yeah, I already told you I turned 26, but it was such a beautiful birthday. First of all, we had a meeting for book club. If you know me, you know I run a book club and we read books every month and we discuss them at the end of the month and then pick another book and we keep the cycle going. But we don't, we don't like put you in a box in the sense that you only get to read that, that one book. You could do even three or four, depending on how you want to read. So for me, I do at least two or three books a month. So I have to challenge myself. I have to read more because I'm the leader of that group. So I need to be upfront with everything that I'm doing and working so hard and stuff like that. So yeah, so we were in this book club meeting 
and my sweethearts my friends decided to organize a surprise birthday so it happened and i was so surprised i couldn't believe it like why why are people so sweet brenda why are you so sweet ah uh, she did such an amazing job she planned everything together and guess what i never saw it coming a surprise birthday fyi and then the man decides to go down on his knees you had me right you <laughs> you had me right because your girl is ah your girl is of the market yes she got a rock can you see this can you see i don't know can you see this i'm trying to focus it yeah yeah you can see oh yeah i made my nails i had to look nice oh yes so that the ring can pop and <laughs> you guys yeah so i got the ring and uh i'm engaged like you guys how serious is that like now you're gonna be someone's wife you have to behave yourself you have to be all these things ah you guys <laughs> ah. yeah but legit it's legit guys it was in public okay not really in public but i really loved how he did it like you guys this guy knows me too much that he made sure i was around the people that care most to me i'm such a private human being yes i'm such a private human being what i mean is i am more into intimate circles i am more into intimate spaces i respect family so much i respect friendship so much and my inner circle that is it that is it yo and he did it just how i've ever thought about it yeah i know i have to keep talking like this so you can see that mm -hmm. yeah you guys anywho yeah so that happened and that's what i've been up to guys that's what i've been up to so nothing much it's been overwhelming but mostly work is what has been overwhelming but i am so glad to be back i'm so glad to be back you guys and i cannot wait to enjoy the rest of the journey together you know you guys there's this and then there's me turning 26 and what there's a lot there's a lot that is happening and now with everything that is going on i'm just trying to stay positive trying to do best trying to yeah and now the pandemic happened and i know i'm just here ranting and when i say when when i say there's a lot going it's because the pandemic now is just making everything so difficult it's just making business hard it's making the economy even go down as much a tad to like it's crazy it's crazy it's crazy it's crazy it's crazy guys it's crazy guys but please stay safe stay seen wear your mask wash your hands stay clean sanitize please carry a sanitizer in your bag all the time yeah and i'm gonna see you next time i haven't quite yet figured out the day that i'm gonna shoot but in the mornings would be best for me so maybe tuesday or wednesday quite yet not that i haven't quite yet figured that out so i think i think i'll just keep you on the loop so when this video goes up probably that's when i'm gonna be shooting but no today is wednesday is it wednesday or tuesday i don't even know you guys but anyway whatever day it is i'll still be uploading content and tell me what do you want to hear what do you want to hear like it feels so ah <sighs> thank you for being here thank you thank you so much god bless you i love you and as usual i have to love you and leave you okay so cheers thank you so much for being here i bless you and uh may god keep shining your path he is the one the light that his word is the light that lights our path and uh may he keep lighting your path may he straighten your path so that you become prosperous in everything that you do okay okay somebody 
okay so i guess that's it that's it there was really nothing much or too much to catch up on and that's what's up that's what's up so enjoy enjoy watching this video please subscribe share and comment down below and uh yeah let's know what you want to know let me know what you want to listen to what you want to watch what you'd like me to talk about because at this point i'm trying to get back to get back into uh, okay so bye